Hi, I'm Michelle. I'm Kat. And we're Two Farm Chicks in Alaska bringing another wig review to you. Today I'm reviewing a free dress equal Kimora, which is one of my all-time favorite wigs in color F437, which is a great color for me. And Kara's reviewing <laughs> Another one from the Miso collection, the Miso 302 in color Moonstone. That her fabulous assistant is holding up for you to see. Can you see it? No. Um. <laughs> there you go. Okay. Crazy. Um, as you can see, I'm reviewing another big hair wig because I like big hair and I can't deny. No. Uh, <laughs> No. <laughs> this hair has those pretty spiral curls all over it. This color is fabulous. And this wig, can you see? It's a lot longer than the last one we did. Wait, turn back. What? Turn back. Right. It's a lot longer than the um, wig we had on yesterday, the Nari wig. This is the color cascades down, so the top. I was kind of surprised by this color because my other 437s are mostly a light brownish red. Um, this gets a lot darker on the ends. Oops, where is it? It gets a lot darker than I would have expected a plain 437 to get. But still, it looks nice. I have this wig also in an F3233. Hmm. Four something, maybe. Or three something. Or maybe one something. I don't know. But I get compliments on it whenever I wear it. The colors are graduated. It looks like it's growing out of your head. It's got a little bit of parting space and some baby hairs that you can see. But if you like big hair and you like this color, which is awesome. I don't know if you can see it because it's getting dark here in Alaska. This is kind of a light reddish brown with some dark brown and some blondes in it too. Um... This is a, a wonderful wig if you like big hair, and I do. Kara's turn. Okay, this is Miso 302 in Moonstone. Mom, no, no. Okay, um, it's got the big boingy curls. I that like. I also love. I don't like tiny spiral curls. I like this kind of curl. Um, it's got uh, Swiss lace, so it's softer than that lace. The hard lace on this one. <laughs> um, I didn't think I'd like it because it's blonde, but I don't mind. Mm. Uh, is Did you got a big... Bob's butt? <laughs> <laughs> it's got a big cap like the other one, so I either have a really small head or it's just really big. And... <laughs> Yeah, I like the hairline because it's a nice hairline and it looks um, like natural until you do that and then it comes off. But yeah, um, the Miso yeah. wigs have a W hairline, W shaped hairline, so it looks a lot more natural. Um, it comes down like she has a widow's peak, and it comes down and goes up. And it, if it was stuck to her head, you could <laughs> see all the lace contours as opposed to um the free Tress equal which is also a lace front but um it's hard lace and i noticed that Kara and i are both allergic to this lace if you keep it near the top of your head or something you get a breakout so if you have sensitivities to things keep that in mind and don't put it down on your uh, on your eyebrows <laughs> <laughs> Okay. <laughs> but um, this hair on the Miso wig is wonderful. I have the same wig in the same color. It doesn't look as good on me because the blonde is a little off. Um, it's really soft. Yeah. The, so the cap is soft. The hair is soft. It's got like two and a half inches of parting space, which is good because I like parting it. And I put it in a ponytail and I skate and I was spinning and it didn't come off. So that was good. And I only used the combs because I forgot bobby pins. 
But if you are going to put this wig on and your head is not as large as my head, more like Kara's head. What? You, you might want to clip it on. To I'm your, so rude. You might want to clip it on to your head if you're going to spin while you skate. You are so mean to me. <laughs> Otherwise, I'm very pleased with this hair. Um, and Kara is very pleased with her Miso late, Lace Front Wig from Miss Wig Collection. And um, the Miss Wig came from their website, which is... That's Miso, Mom, not Miss Wig. No, no, I'm talking about it. Miss Wigs, is it MissWigs.com? Yes. Yes, you can go there to find the it Miso was, Wigs. It was forty six ninety nine, I think. Unless you have a little discount. I think we paid 44 something for it. And the um, Kimura I got from MimiBeauty.com. MimiBeautyLine.com. Yeah, MimiBeautyLine. And they're really nice about working with you and getting you things. Uh, one of the things that we end up really hating up here in Alaska is shipping. Because for some reason people think they need to charge you a million dollars to ship you... Um, any kind of item here. Because apparently we're not part of the U.S. Yeah, no, there you go. Um, don't go for that crap. Mimi Line. was it? MimiBeautyLine.com. And um, Miss Wigs and Hair Stop and Shop all have free shipping if you order a certain amount, which we always have more than um, in our wig things. And you can get free shipping with them. And they have great customer service and terrific products. I like. And we're not paid to say that. <laughs> I like samsbeauty.com, but it only worked for me, and it wouldn't work for her. Really <laughs> awful, awful shipping. Yeah, shipping was bad. Shipping was like almost $26, yeah. I think. on some eyeshadow. Yeah, I got, my my order was only like 27 but then I had to pay 50 altogether, so yeah. it was pretty bad. Mm -hmm. Don't do that. But the products were good, so it was okay. Great. Don't do that. You can find them on Amazon for no shipping. Um, this is the mama that pays. Don't do that. Hey, I bought my own stuff on Sam's. Good job. Okay, so thanks for sitting in on our wig review today. We'll come back and see you again as soon as we get some more hairs on. Hairs? <laughs> well, actually, no. It's time to go feed cows. No, it's not. It's only four. It's getting dark. It's only four. We don't go up to six. <laughs> Have a good day.